My name is Raquel. I'm Jessica. And we are going to be your coaches for the duration of this challenge. So this week, we are starting off our prep week. We spend an entire week getting ourselves organized and ready to start day one next Monday. So we're going to talk about several things. Number one, we'll talk about your nutrition. What should it look like? You're going to get some containers in the mail that I promise you when you get them, <laughs> you're going to think they're like the tiniest little things. They must have been meant for Thumbelina, but I promise <laughs> you it's a lot of food. We're also going to talk about Shakeology. What is it? Why do we use it? How should you make it? How do you make sure it tastes great and find your favorite recipe? And then lastly, we're going to work on before pictures and measurements. Don't skip this part. Number one, you need your before pictures so you can submit your after and get your free shirt and who doesn't want a free shirt. Number two, you've got to be able to look back on your progress. Even if you don't look at it at all, you may not look at it for months months but you're going to want that picture down the line so that you can see that your hard work is paying off. So before we get started with all of that, we just want to get to know you a little bit more. So in the comments below, we want to know who you are, where you're from, and <laughs> what excuse you're not going to use during this challenge. So I'll start us off. I'm Raquel. I live in Buda, which is right outside of Austin. And the excuse that I'm not going to use is that I have a million kids. I really only have three. Um, but I'm not going to let that be my excuse that I'm too busy and I'm too tired because I'm trying to keep track of my kids. So that's where, I, where I'm from and what I do. So my name is Jessica. I, I work full time from home. I spend very little time in the office and I also do coaching full time from home with two kids. So it's basically a zoo 24 <laughs> seven. So if you are running a crazy life, I feel your pain. She feels your pain. We are in this together. Um, an excuse that I will not be using is that I deserve it. I have a little problem with the I deserve it tool. I deserve some pizza. I Chocolate, deserve some M&Ms. Wine. I definitely deserve a bottle of wine. I deserve not to work out because I've worked out four days. So that's what I'm not going to be doing and maybe some things that you may be plugging into your ears. We don't deserve it. We deserve to feel good. We deserve to push each other. And I promise you when I jump into these <laughs> groups and I see everybody else killing their workout, yes. I'm like, oh. I got it So too. use this as accountability because you do deserve to feel better but I will cut that excuse from my vocabulary because I am committed to you and I'm committed to this process. Alright, can't wait to get to know more about you. Bye guys! You, you.